Hi, welcome. We are actually not on Qtown, not anymore. This is going to be a video for ArcoLinuxISO.com. At some point in time, we'll start with a project so how to make an Arch Linux based ISO yourself and start making your own distro or your own community. Now, this video is about GitHub, about maintenance, and about, well, cleaning up, really. And um, let me show you what I mean. We have different repos, and every repo has a hidden folder. It's called a .git. And a .git is where it keeps track of all the changes. Now, if you check out the properties, then this thing is one terabyte big. So all the changes that are in this Arconix repo can be reversed. That's the idea. So they can turn the clock back and get the, the repo packages back, in this case, for, for, from two years ago. But we don't want that. We will never want that. We don't need the history. We don't want the backup. But it keeps on piling and piling up. Now, it takes, of course, some hard space, but that's I really don't care. I have enough space as it is. But it is becoming bigger and bigger all the time. 1.3 gigabyte. And in this case, and this is the one we'll use it to test it with. This is the easiest one, the, the smallest one. That's the one from the repo testing. So that's where we put stuff in that we say, beta testers, try it out. We've tried it out and uh, we think it's okay, but please try it. And then it's released. The properties of this one is astonishing. It's 2.2 gigabytes of the repo ISO. So the one that we're using for to get uh, the build of the ISO, that's this one is the main one. There's the Firefox, no, not the Firefox. The Valley is in there. Um, all kinds of packages like the cursor for Breeze, etc., etc. So this thing is getting really, really big. And there are, so I've made a little command. I'm going to try it out and show you guys with um, repo testing. So that's the smallest one and the least harm uh, to it. Because if you have a community, you have to make sure that nothing breaks, that not, nobody is, is getting into trouble because of your actions. So what does this entitle? Let's open this thing up. The thing is, I'm going, going to move a file. In here is one file that's super important, that's this guy. That's a super important file. And it looks like this. It tells me or tells uh, the system git that the URL is this URL. Get it from there. So I don't want to lose the URL. Otherwise I have to fill it in again. And that's, that's uh, not necessary. So I'm first going to move from the .git config. I'm going to move the, this, this file to one level up, right? Then I'm going to remove forcefully everything that's contained in the .git. So no folder anymore, no .git anymore. So this is all gone and this folder as well, it's gone. Then um, when that's, that's done, I'm going to use this setup script, which we don't have yet. So this setup script, control C to repo testing, control V. I'm going to use this setup script to, all right, to actually say, well, that's a lot of stuff that's not needed, but it's okay. This is just what we need. Initialize the Git, say Merrick, say that's my mail. Of course, you need to change it if you have a uh, your proper distro and then some configurations and everything. The, the .git file, the .git folder, sorry, is going to be recreated with this thing. So we get the git.git back. If the .git is back, I'm going to move the config file that I just moved up here back inside. So I have my URL back in. Tell to add everything. So then G, the general commands are there to add everything to the list to, to how's it called again? That has a name. Uh, staging, I think is the name. And then you commit everything with a name. Okay, this is just a monthly cleanup. And then you forcefully say, overwrite everything that's back on there. So that's basically what I'm going to do. And let's try it out. So like I said, this is a repo testing. 
so no not much uh, problem not much harm can be done but with other repos you have to well make sure it works so let's do a cleanup so initializing the, the git repository he wants to know my name that's my name it's going to create everything again upload everything again and that's done the script ran and i have here a properties and we have now 48 i'm uh, sorry 28.4 kilobytes so nothing really in our dot git so that's um a success story and i'm going to do now of course without video all the rest so all these guys this one will benefit really from it since it's 2.2 gigabytes time to clean up all right have fun